primary thing that we've been focusing on now is, is prostate cancer. One of the issues people have with prostate cancer, I guess it's, it's threefold. It's diagnosis, determining how to, to, if someone has cancer, man has cancer or not. Uh, the second would be determining whether that man's cancer should be treated or not. And then the third is treating them and making sure that they're treated properly. The technology that I'm specifically focused on researching involves looking at the electrical properties of tissue. It turns out that the electrical properties, this is basically how current flows through tissue, varies depending on the tissue type. So a cancer tumor, for instance, has a much different cellular structure than benign tissues do. The whole intent of surgery is to remove the entire tumor. Uh, oftentimes there's small islands of cells that are left behind afterwards. What we would ideally like to do is be able to intraoperatively, so in the OR, see where there are cells left behind and let the surgeon know that these cells are there so they can remove the additional uh, tumor cells. And so we've developed these technologies that interface to surgical tools and the surgeon uses them to go and probe around the tissue spaces after the tumor's been removed. So for instance, we've developed biopsy needles that have electrical property sensors embedded on the tip. And this allows a surgeon to obtain in real time diagnostic information about a tissue type. One of the ways the technologies I'm developing are gonna help, for instance, a patient undergoing surgery is that we're going to ensure that the entire tumor is removed so that this patient won't have a recurrence five years down the road.